the guitar racing handicap is next um, it's a 10 furlong race 0 to 90 for three year olds top one is galloping cure for james shea the best of us for joshua sutherland Dial Witzemella for Thomas Rogers, Shillingstone Games, Mike Westwood, Plimsoll Nusha, James Shea, Zagalini's Baldini, Dan Hughes, Geisha Kate for Ryan Costello, Rise All Star, Thomas Rogers, San Silly Servant, David Hooley, Temple of the King, Martin Leadham, Heavy Rain, Obi Wan, Royal Alchemist, Jim Murray, and Dr. Blonde, Ryan Costello. So, fall in then, some good names in this one, and away they go. And who's going to be the first to show? Looks like it might be the best of us who's just about going to be the best of them at the moment. So the best of us in the lead then from Shillingstone Games in the pink jacket in second. Then Royal Alchemist is third and Plimsoll Nusha is after that one. Then Heavy Rain towards the back temple of the king is the back marker. That was a two-time winner last season and got disqualified from first twice as well. be interesting to see if that one's trained on as a three-year-old. Didn't look like he had last week, but it's Shillingstone Games and the best of us who are disputing the lead. And the best of us is just about getting the best of the battle. My leads by about three quarters of a length to Shillingstone Games in second. Plimstone, Nusha and Royal Alchemist are next. And then Heavy Rain after that one. The ones over on, on this near side, Zagalini's Baldini in the blue jacket. And the green with the maroon cap is Rise All-Star. Who are towards the back. The two Ryan Costello horses, Dr. Blon and Geisha Kate are also out the back. But it's the best of us who's in the lead from Shillingston Games in second as they come down past the five furlong mark then. The best of us in front, Shillingston Games in second, Plimsoll Nusha is going well in third, the 2000 Guineas winning trainer, Jim Murray's got Royal Alchemist on the rail, then comes Heavy Rain and Galloping Curies after that one, Diawitz and Mellor's also trying to get into it, Temple of the King trying to get a little bit closer, as well as uh, San Silly Servant, Rise All Star still struggling out the back, but now the best of us is about to be challenged by Plimsoll Nusha, and also coming up the centre of the track, Zagalini's Baldini, the yellow jacketed Heavy Rain is trying to get going as well, but they've still got to get to this leader who's going really well in front and it's going exceptionally well in front in fact the best of us in the lead then by a good two lengths from Plimson Nusha Zagalini's Baldini then comes Royal Alchemist but they haven't got to the best of us yet Zagalini's Baldini racing on its own is going to have to find it hard work racing by itself but it's the best of us who's in the lead got the rail and is still going well into the final furlong the best of us in the lead Zagalini's Baldini and Plimson Nusha quite a few of these haven't got into this race at all and now Zagalini's Baldini bursts into the lead Zagalini's Baldini racing up towards the line Zagalini's Baldini's going to take him the Fast finishing Royal Alchemist, then the best of us was after that one. And Zagalini's Baldini, a good winner, a brave winner as well, to win it, running on its own up the centre of that track with no company has taken it quite comfortably in the end. The best of us stuck on for third, Royal Alchemist finishing really well, got up to be second. Let's take a full look at the list then. It's Zagalini's Baldini for Dan Hughes, the winner. Royal Alchemist for Jim Murray was second. The best of us, Joshua Sutherland, third. Geisha Cape for Ryan Costello, ran on well to be fourth. And Rise All-Star for Thomas Rogers was fifth.